I see you, friend. I'll help you out presently. Hope your trip is uneventful. No way he would have gone back to calm of his there own you volition. Are. Come on, keep walking. You're late. A couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave forever. We've been doing well, making money, but for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia or Tahiti. We just need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific. An untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. Oh, how are we gonna get enough money for the passage of a whole boat, a captain's discretion, and land enough to keep us all? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then well, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me, and you all will. Now, remember, we just want money. Don't make us kill you. Mr. M. You Please need to give me all your money now. Mr. Okay. S, check that room back there. I got this one. Dying. That's your choice. Not mine. Kindly. Okay. okay. Give me everything you've got. Inside. Quick. All right. There's everything, okay? I said open the gate and let my acquaintance in. Come on. Yes. These folks must of have course. Don't move a goddamn Check muscle. them all, Mr. M. I don't want anyone feeling left out. All your money now. Don't make me ask twice. Okay. Fine, it's yours. There's nothing much here. What? There's nothing really here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here and get ready for company. All of you! Behave! We don't want to hurt any of you. Mr. M, check the safe. Sure. Ah! That is not what we do, damn it. You know that. There you are. Come on, keep walking. You're late. A couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock-watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave forever. 
We've been doing well, making money, but for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia or Tahiti. We just need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear, be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific, an untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. <sighs> How are we gonna get enough money for the passage of a whole boat, a captain's discretion, and land enough to keep us all? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then, well, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on! Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me, and you all will. Now remember, we just want money. Don't make us kill you. Mr. M, leave these fine folks or their valuables. Mr. S, check that room back there. I got this one dying. That's your choice, not mine. Kindly open that gate and let my acquaintance inside. And do you want I me said, to open, open the gate this? and let my acquaintance in. Yes, of course. Why aren't their pockets no, empty yet, Mr. M? You got on you. Of course, of course, just take it. Give me your money. It ain't worth dying on. This is it. Of nothing else. All your money now. There's Don't nothing make much me here. Ask twice. What? There's okay, nothing okay. really got here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here and get ready for company. All of you! Behave. We don't want to hurt any of you. Now don't make any dumb moves. Mr. M, check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it! There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn! We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. Come on now! We got you surrounded! That greasy son now. of a bitch! He set us up! You think? This seemed like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur. What are we gonna do, gentlemen? Something! The trolley. The trolley! Follow me, gentlemen! Go! Now! Go! Does this trolley go to Tahiti? I hope so! Hold them off, fellas! We got more on the right! We got some in those alleyways, Arthur. Hand up on that balcony! We got some riders on the left! Arthur, help Lenny out there! Arthur, you need to help Lenny now! Get that bastard! Uh, look out! Right! Coming out of the back! That bastard must have called in every cop in the city. Let's get a shit! Outside the saloon! Aw, oh, damn. We are really moving here. Or Slow it down! Slow this thing down! I'll try. The thing's broke. Hold on! Let me go round him! 
I think we're clear. 
You know what, Dutch? Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. <clears throat> thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. Well, we each got... Fifteen dollars. Oh, and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. He set us up. Played me like a yokel. Put the law on us. What did we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So... What are we doing next, Dutch? We just need money. One more decent take, and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Hosea agrees. Even after that? Uh, especially after that. Uh, I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on. I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, can't win them all. <laughs> <laughs>